Upon dissection, we remove most of the organs. The first organ we're going to show is the stomach, which is responsible for chemical digestion of the food ingested. The second organ we're going to show is the liver. The liver is largely responsible as an accessory organ of digestion and helps with detoxification of the body. Here we are showing the small and large intestine. The small intestine is on the left. As you can see, it's much more smaller and longer. It's responsible for absorption of nutrients. And then the large intestine, which is on the right, which is bigger, is responsible for water absorption and helping to excrete waste. This is the pancreas. This is the affected organ in our disorder, and it's responsible as an accessory organ of digestion. We have adenocarcinoma, which is malignant cancer cells of the pancreas. So the patient came to us with many symptoms like nausea after eating, abdominal pain, bloated, gas, fever, blood and stool, a bunch of other symptoms. So basically, upon much medical questioning and extensive tests done, we concluded that it's adenocarcinoma of the pancreas, meaning essentially that it's pancreatic cancer. The pancreas that we've shown would end up being enlarged because the white blood cells would be attacking the foreign cancer cells, so it would be much bigger. Additionally, there would be probably a tumor or a lump of cells, like an abnormal growth on the pancreas. The pancreas is an accessory organ responsible in digestion. It helps with the chemical breakdown of the food. Its large responsibility is in bile. It surrounds the bile production and storage. Refer to our brochure for more information on pancreatic cancer.